I had about 12 to 18 months of feeling really off and icky, always just getting sick, always feeling tired and just no, never being able to get on top of it. And so I was going to the doctor over and over and just kept getting told, you're fine, you're stressed, you know, we did tests but they didn't really get anywhere. And so, yeah, I had a long period of time of feeling really unwell and just not doing much about it. The turning point for me was that my parents actually really insisted that I go and see a specialist because they were really worried about the fact that I was having night sweats night after night. And so I went and saw a haematologist, got some more tests done, and that's when we found that I had stage four Hodgkin's lymphoma. I think I'd been so unwell for so long, it all just starts to blur into one. And I just got to the point where I thought, maybe this is just what growing up feels like. This is what it is like to be an adult. And that's not right. And so I'd say to anyone, if you are feeling unwell for a long period of time, you need to get that checked and delve into what is going on and don't stop until you've got answers. I say to everyone now that you are the world's leading expert on you. You're the only one who knows what it's like to be inside that body of yours. And if you know something's off, you just have to keep investigating until you have answers. And so you need to find a GP that takes your pain and your situation really seriously and will look into everything for you. And I suggest people say to their GP, what else should I do? What's next? What's the next step? You know, really you have to be quite persistent, always friendly of course, and always, you know, kind, but really don't let them off the hook. Keep asking, what's next? What would you do in this situation? Who else can I see? What else would you advise? When you've been feeling bad or something's been off for a long time, that starts to become your normal. And so I think it's really important to take notes of everything, keep a record of how you're feeling so that when you go to your GP, you've got a really clear idea of all your symptoms and over what time frame they've been happening. I'm three years in remission and I feel really incredibly grateful to be in remission. Uh, however, I am still dealing with fatigue and a lot of symptoms like that. And it's tough because you just want to get straight back into your life, how it was, but you've just got to accept that and go with how you feel and honor that. Um, but yeah, so I would just say to anyone, if something feels off, if it feels funny, don't wait, don't put things off. I'm quite bad at life admin myself, but you've got to get on top of your life admin, get those tests done and follow up straight away.